Now, listen up, you guys. Sandra Bullock has been talking about explaining racism to her adopted son, Louis, who is African American. Now, Sandra said it's an open conversation that we have. He fully understands what that means. Wow. He doesn't understand why people judge each other based on the color of their skin, but he knows they do. So I obviously want to ask you guys, the parents at the table, Adam and Tamara, would you talk to Aiden about racism when he gets older? Absolutely. Yeah, I mean, for me, obviously, we have a unique situation. Um, I think it's not just race. There's a lot of people in this world that treat people different for... Race is one of them, and it's not acceptable, but there's a lot of reasons why people do stuff like that. I don't understand it. I wasn't raised that way, and mm-hmm. I, I don't know people that were raised that way, thank God. Having said that, you know, at least with me, I know with us, I think we probably agree on this, you have to kind of wait until he sees it or you Absolutely. see it with him. And that is, that's what happened with, with my family. You guys, I didn't know that my mom was like black and my dad was white per se until I experienced something at school. About how, um, how old were you? I was, honestly, I was like eight. I just saw my mom as mom. I just saw my dad as yeah. dad. And that's how we want to raise our kids right. so we can show them this is how it's supposed to be. Yeah. But then when it happens, that's when you, you know, uh, have that conversation. I remember coming home saying, Mom, somebody called me the, the N-word and they found out that I was, of, I was black and I was mixed, of mixed race. And I didn't understand. The, the, the little girl actually stopped being my friend. And I didn't, I didn't understand why... She found out that when I was black, she didn't want to be my friend anymore. Wow. So Crazy. I told my mom, and mom said, you know what, Tamira? That is somebody who is uneducated, mm-hmm. and that is somebody who is being stupid. We are not yep. those type of people. Wow. I'm, I'm also, I'll be honest, I'm also, you know, because, because of our unique situation, you know, Aiden is a little bit lighter than Araya. Right. And so I'm waiting for someone to say something when I'm around. Uh-oh. <laughs> Because I'll be honest with you, as, as, Tamara, as Tamara knows, we, we get it from all sides. There's no... Uh, That's right. Yeah, and, 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 and don't accept it. And I just think it comes back to, you know what, you, there's a time and a place. And I think if, if her son's ready for that, she'll know. She's, she's his mom. I think we're just going to show our children how it's supposed to be. And then, if, you know, when they experience something like or that. Or we that's, see it together. Or we somehow. see it together. Yeah, that's when we'll talk. Because we have yeah. I mean, as you guys know, I mean, you guys have been with Hank. We, we don't care where you, what you look like, where you come from, no. how much yeah. money you got. Y'all got all kind of colors I mean, in y'all face. And ages, We really I mean, do. My, my grandma, when she was 80, would hang out at parties at my house. 80-year-old with, like, you know, my 21-year-old friends. And she would sit in the couch and tell a story. I mean, so we don't care. And my sister-in-law is Filipino. Filipino. We, are, yeah. we are one blended family. Your best family. friend is Latina. Latina. My best friend is Latina. Yeah. Yeah. You guys obviously have, you know, a lot of followers on Instagram and all that kind of stuff. But to me, sometimes I think that in this day and age, as we all are evolving and moving forward, mm-hmm. that the idiots get more sound, That's get more, true. get more, you know, they get more attention than they would have ever gotten 25 years ago. Because they have a social media now on social media. They have a platform. Media. When the, when a the truth is, most platform, of the people in this, but... in this country are moving forward and realizing it don't matter if you're pink, green, blue, orange, you know, I don't care. You, everyone is the same. It's what's inside. Right. And I think mm-hmm. most of us know that. But there's, it, there's still idiots out there that have this new, they have these new ways that they can put out their, honestly, their stupid thoughts. Well, that's why people try to say, oh, you should just ignore it. No, sometimes you have to recognize well, you know. it yeah, yeah. and tell Absolutely. them. Yeah. You're Absolutely. not going to do this today. Not yeah. on my timeline. You know, you know. You're not going to do this. Yeah. We, no. you, you guys, we both, we, we both know Oh, that. you know, we yeah. know that. So. And to recognize that everybody has a story. No matter exactly. where they yep. come from, they yep. have a story and it deserves to be told. And, it deserves to be and heard. And big ups to Sandra Bullock because yeah. you know what? You're doing your thing. We appreciate you, Sandra. We really, really do.